Hey, before this video starts, I just want to say thank you for the support. I really do appreciate it. I'm trying to get 100,000 subscribers, so if you want to help me out, make sure to subscribe. Now enjoy the video. Come in, come in. <clears throat> my, my, my. What do we have here? Hello, Miss Yellow. Yes, you can come in. Come in. Why, I'm just taking a little bit to myself, you know. Always gotta test the product before selling. <laughs> but come in, come in, come in. So, what gives me the privilege to be seeing the uh, beautiful Miss Yellow themselves, huh? Ah, I see, I see, well... Hmm... Well, uh, I have uh, just a few things that I would like to talk to you about, that's all. That's why I've been talking about you so much. We haven't talked in a while, so I wanted to see if, uh, well, if you were available. See, si, see. Si. Well, now that I see you are available, hi, I've missed you, and also I wanted to check up on you. So, how have you been? That's good. I'm glad you're actually going into hero work now. You have a lot of, uh, a lot ahead of you now. Because you're doing actual pro hero work instead of, uh, training. <laughs> a lot of people are going to look up to you now. You sure that's not going to be hard to handle? I'm not saying you're not incapable of, uh, Handling, said, uh, you know, fame and whatnot. But it can be a lot on somebody's plate who is uh, um, brand new to this. Mm-hmm. All right. And uh, how has your training been ever since you've been doing uh, the hero work and whatnot? Well, I'm glad it's working out great for you. I mean, you look fantastic. Fantastic, oh, that's what I say. You look amazing. Of course. I've also been trying to work on myself a little bit, but also ever since the whole, uh, the, the escapees and whatnot that are uh, running around in the city, I can't really uh, go to my regular shop and sell my product. So I had to bring a lot of it and also get it... Uh, into reasonable standards is what the people uh, the building said via endeavor and whatnot. I had to get it to regular sizes and I have to now sell them here on a on a nine store. But they have to come to here because one is shelter and two I can't really go out there unless I wanna get mugged. And three, it's a lot more easier for me. If we're all in the same building, you all can just go up to my room and then I'll give you your things, you give me the cash. It's as easy as that. Well, I mean, not give me the cash, but some people have done that. They walk to my door, it's like, I would like to, blah, 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 blah. You get it. They pay online, I give them the stuff. That's what happens. See, si, see. Si. It's a lot more uh, complicated. Then to explain it more than just to show it. See. Si. 
And me? Well, I mean, besides being to do with the, the, the whole hero thing, I've just basically been doing this. And also just hanging out and living my regular life that I would usually do after I'm done working. See, although nowadays I never feel like I'm never working because I got this online store and I also have to do the hero thing. I had uh, patrols almost every other day. But luckily I get to bring somebody with me to the patrols. And I usually bring over Mina because, well, she understands my type of humor and stuff like that. It was either her, her Mirko, or Bakugo. That's you I usually uh, pick for my help. Well, that's a simple answer, Micello, the scheduling. I can't really work with you on the same days because, well, scheduling. And plus, as of recently, scheduling's been off the charts by now. You will understand. See, si, see. Si. But I do apologize for not talking to you. I know it's been a while, but like I said, I've been super busy. Si, see. Si. Are you still getting trained under the, the Hawks and Endeavor? You are? Okay. I was just asking because, well, I didn't know if you were going under new management or anything like that. Hmm. Just making sure, that's all. Do you need anything to drink? By any chance, I have a mini fridge. No? You don't want nothing? You sure? Okay. Excuse me, cotton mouth. <laughs> Excuse me again. But, uh, going back on topic, have you ever thought of uh, going under noon management or anything like that? Well, I'm just asking because I have good management under uh, Fat Gum. He does really good things for his team. I mean, he, after all, he is here because, you know, the whole thing. And uh, uh, he's, I'm under his management, and so is uh, Kirishima and uh, the, the, I always forget his name. Sun Eater. What is his name? Tamaki. There it is. Uh, I'm under, yeah, he's also under uh, Farcom management. He's super good to his people, pays him well, also feeds them well. The man never gives me a break when it comes to eating. He always wants to learn something about my culture. About how do we make our hot sauces, or even the, how we make our guacamole, and the, the frijo, frijoles, and the, basically, goddamn everything. <laughs> He's a very hungry man. I mean... If you have to use a power that uses all the fat in your body, I'm pretty sure you would have that weight on you too, right? Right. So I'm not one to say no to my, uh, my, uh, yeah, my management. So I always give him recipes that my mom gave me and her mom gave her. And, and he makes these great meals out of it. I'm not even kidding. I don't know how he does it. But he has the freshest ingredients every time. Maybe because the, most of the, the head refugees here need fresh food and whatnot and water. So they bring a lot more fresher stuff here than they do to the stock the shelves. Mm -hmm. But he makes amazing food. I remember this one time. Uh, he made uh, burrito tacos. And... Uh, I can tell you the juices on that thing. Mwah, spices and everything. Peppers and onion. You can s taste everything he put into that. The man puts his whole arm and leg when you're cooking. I gotta learn some lessons from him, eh? Because all I got up here is a few basic meats and whatnot. And I need to 
restock my spices. See, si, see. Si. I make basic meals up here, unless I'm down in the kitchen. See, si, see. Si. Well, I'll keep your uh, I'll keep your uh, name in handy, and I'll make sure the fat gum makes you something for you know just to have. Si, si. Well, uh, while you're still here, I mean, we can hang out a little bit more. I have a few more uh, strains I have to get through. <laughs> well, my mother always says I always have a silver tongue. Come sit. Let's have some fun. <laughs>